Hi, Nikki Grimes again. Now I've read you a couple of chapters from Make Way for Diamond Daniel, published by Penguin. Um, but now I want to read you a chapter from the second book in the series called Rich. Okay, so this is a chapter from Rich. Again, these are books that you can find at the library or at IndieBound.com, uh, BarnesandNoble.com, and Amazon.com. Or whatever your favorite bookseller is. Okay, so here we go, Rich. Diamond and Free stood in front of a store window. I hate being poor, said Free. Ever since my dad lost his job, all my mom seems to say is, we can't afford this and we can't afford that. Diamond Daniel would not trade free for anything. He was her best friend, wasn't he? But that boy had a lot to learn. First off, said Diamond, I've seen you buy lots of things. And second, you are not poor. Then how come I can't buy that new video game? My mom says everybody wants something they can't have, said Diamond. That don't, doesn't make you poor. Well, what do you call it then? Not having money right now, said Diamond. Same thing, grumbled Free. No, it isn't, said Diamond. Poor is... Hmm, Diamond thought for a moment. Poor is having no clothes and no food and no place to live and nobody who cares. I guess, said Free. I still wish I could get that new video game. Well then, said Diamond, you better get to school so you can graduate, so you can get a job, so you can buy your own video game. Forget it then, said Free. Diamond play punched him in the arm. You call that a punch? You punch like a girl, said Free. Diamond pulled her arm back and punched him for real this time. Ouch! I was just kidding. Come on then, said Diamond. And hurry, Mrs. Cordell said she'd have a surprise for us today. Mm. What is that surprise? Well, you'll have to find out in chapter two. Bye for now.